Hello everyone, I'm Joshua Clement and today I'm going to talk to you about how to replace the padding for your floors. So what we're going to have to do is remove the old padding and staples, get our new padding into place, cut it to size, and staple it down. For this job, you will need a stapler, a pair of pliers, flathead screwdriver, and a pair of scissors. The first step is to grab a hold of your padding and just pick it up. You'll be left with staples in your subfloor. To get those out, we'll be using the flathead screwdriver to be able to go underneath it, pry it up, and then grab it with the pair of pliers and twist it to the side. And you'll have to do this across your entire floor. After that's done, you're going to take your new padding, put it across your floor, Grab your pair of scissors and you want to cut it back away from your tack strip a little bit. That way you have room to take your carpet and fold it over into the back of the tack strip. So we'll take the pair of scissors and leave about a half inch from our tack strip. After that's done, we'll start in the corner with our stapler put a staple in there and then we'll smooth out our pad and put another staple and work our way down the wall smoothing it out and stapling it down. Then we'll go to the middle of our piece kind of stretch it over and staple a line all the way down through the middle. You want to make sure that you don't overstretch it because it could rip. And after that, you're ready for carpet installation. Knowing how to properly install padding can save you from bubbling up carpet and having seams that are messed up in your carpet to where it's not laying right. Thank you all for watching and good luck with this project.